Good morning, everyone. <laughs> another day another vlog we had plans to go apple picking today things ended up changing i'll kind of explain it in the car because i have to leave to pick up josh but yeah i got new earrings i was like oh i want gold hoops and now that they're in my ear i just don't think they look good on me for some reason i don't know why i just don't feel like they look good on me this is my outfit for the day it's just jeans with my top and then this cardigan because it's cold out i'm gonna put my hair in a bun in a second and i'm heating up some coffee because i made some coffee this morning and left it out on the counter and never actually ended up drinking it how hot is this it needs to be hotter okay so i'm trying this oreo delight mix so i tried it in an iced coffee like yesterday and i didn't really like it i mean the more i drank it the more i liked it and i felt like it tasted like pringles but i feel like maybe it's going to be better hot so we're going to try it in this hot coffee right now it's hard to explain it's like good but it's not like i don't know like, would I probably buy it again? No. Will I drink it because it's here? Yes. If my eyes were closed and somebody was like, what is this? Would I say Oreo? No. <laughs> it tastes like potato chips at first. And then when you swallow it, I don't know, guys. It's fucking weird. It's weird. I wish these earrings looked good on me. I don't know. They just don't. They don't suit me, I feel like. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. I don't feel like they suit me. Like, this is what I'm looking like right now. I mean, they kind of suit me in the mirror when you look, but... My extensions make me look like I'm going bald. But it's just my extensions pulling. I don't know. Hey everyone, I'm walking through this fucking alley. So I brought, so my car came from Alberta. It's like a rebuilt title, right? And since I brought it to Ontario, I guess you're supposed to um, like get a structural report or something. So I was like, all right, bet. So I went to the ministry, waited two hours in line because there's like none of them open right now. So I waited two hours in line like three days ago. The lady's like, you need a structural report. I had all my other paperwork. I was like, fuck. I was like, all right, whatever. So I called this one mechanic and I'm like, yo, I need a, a, an alignment and a structural report. He's like, all right. I went, um, he gave me the, oh shit, I'm about to get hit by a car. He gave me the paper and he's like, this is all they need, this paper. I was like, all right, cool. So I go to the ministry again today. <laughs> I wait two hours again. So like it opens at nine. I went there at seven. I give them that fucking paper and they're like, this is the wrong paper. I'm like, this isn't a structural report. I'm like, dog, you gotta be fucking kidding me. So I brought it to this guy down over here and then he's taking his time on that. He said, come back in an hour. So I have to walk around and try to kill an hour. So that's fun. I'm still walking around. And this is where me and my friends used to like hop on trains. I shot um, that payback music video around here too. Yeah, it's boring. This shit's steep though still. If I fell down this, damn. I feel like they have racing for everything. So I feel like, I feel like somewhere in the world, there's definitely train racing. Someone has to let me know. It's the most random shit I've ever thought about, but it makes sense. They'd be racing horses, they race cars. Do they race trains? There should be a train quarter mile. And if that's not a good, if that's not a good idea, I'm gonna make a little quarter mile track for trains and I'll get like, oh wait, no, that doesn't make sense because then you won't be able to bring the train there. Well, it's just a little bit of morning thought, you know? Holy, that's such a good deal. Those are huge. I kind of want to try. I wonder if there's seeds in them, though. Red glow grape. Guys, we're in a Korean. Oh, I heard this helps with pregnancy. Should I try it? Apparently, it's supposed to help you get pregnant. I probably shouldn't be touching things and putting them back during COVID. I'm so sorry that I did that, guys. I think it's a fruit, I think. These look so fire. We're in a Korean market, so I can get some spicy noodles. But I always end up, like... I could spend hours in here because it's so cool. Dude, I'm about to come here for grapes. Lychee flavored grapes shot up right now. What if they have your cotton candy ones? Guys, we just went to a Korean market. Well, actually, you guys know because I vlogged in there. Um, we oh got yeah, Carly saved me, by the way. Y'all will see my train check. Fun. <laughs> yeah, I picked them up. We got hot chicken flavor ramen because this is basically the spice noodles. We love them. It's way cheaper here. It's like $6 here for five packs. And on Amazon, it's like $14 for five. So you're paying three times the price on Amazon. And then I got dried mangoes for Josh to try. And also, I just really love these. I'm scared to try them. I, I don't eat dry shit like that. It's weird. It creeps me out. 
He's being dramatic. It creeps me out. It literally tastes like candy. If anyone had this, it's chewy like candy. It tastes like candy. It's really good. Anyways, my throat hurts. So, bye. So, Babe's having a rough day. We'll explain it when we get home. So, we're going through Popeyes to get him a chicken sandwich. And we're going to try the new hot honey hi, chicken. I got I got tea today. Hi, can I get um, can I get a number 11 combo, please? Yes, yeah, I didn't drink with that. Yeah, I want, yeah, I want fries and a Diet Coke. That's everything for today. And then can I get another one of those? Can I have three pieces of the hot honey chicken? I have one, uh, one spicy chicken sandwich with fries and coke, and then a three piece hot honey with fries and coke, and then a spicy sandwich on the side. Yeah. Gosh, we need to stop eating out. It's so much cheaper to eat at, eat at home. But this oh, is God. fire. And we have hella food at home too. Whatever. It's in the freezer. It'll never go bad. I'm really excited to try this, the hot honey chicken. I love like sweet and hot. It's like the best. Dude, my eyes are sinking into my head right He's now. He's so tired. Are you gonna have a nap, babe? A little back scratch? I slept, I <laughs> fell asleep at 4 a.m. and I woke up at 6.30. I kept like sleeping, tossing and turning, and then I kept seeing him on his phone and I was like, babe, go to bed. I couldn't sleep. So I tried to make him fall asleep. I am so excited. Like, I love eating like chicken nuggets at McDonald's with honey. It's so fire. You know when you're like really tired and your face just feels like Phew. Yeah. That's what I feel like, yeah. Thanks. Can't wait to drink that. Uh, oh, thank you. Oh yes, finally. Something that's not paper straws. I'm sorry everyone who likes paper straws. I hate them so much. I like them, but I like them because they help the turtles. But like the environment's cool, but you know it's not cool drinking paper when it's like all I should bring my reusable straws in the car. Yeah, that'd be blessed. That'd be helpful. But um, she had to like repeat my order like there was other people in the drive. -thru. I know, we're the only people in the drive through I cannot wait. So I think me and Olivia are going to do this tonight. And we're going to do it on Patreon. And we're just gonna kind of talk and eat because she's never had this before and they're so fire. And I'll make you a pack if you want. Okay guys, we got our Popeye's chicken sandwiches. I'm hot. It's hot. Yeah, me too. You get a whole box of fries. All right, say less. And then... Popeye's has the best fries in the I think it also comes with a biscuit. Oh. Hey, my first video we ate Popeye's. Oh yeah! Yo, that looks fire as shit. My nose is on fire. <laughs> Smell it. Damn. Yeah, I'm trying that. Okay, wait, let's do a thumbnail first. Okay, what part do you want? Do you want us to try this together? Maybe like... Holy, this looks like a... Let me just take a big knob of it. A bite? Yeah. Or should we try this one? Nah, let's try this one. Oh! Hey, okay, yo, chill, let me try it. Why am I dripping it? Damn, that shit's really good. Mm. What the hell? Mm. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is really good. Oh my god. Mm. Fuck the sandwich. I'm working both for sure. <laughs> Get this. Get it. Wow. This chicken's greasy as all hell. It's, look, it's dripping down my hand. It's an artery clog for sure. Mm hmm I don't give a shit. It's so good. Okay, guys. Rate it on a scale of 1 to 10. I rate it a 10. This is the best fried chicken I've ever had from any fast food. I'm going to give it a... I'm going to give it an 8.5. I give it a 10. Why is it an 8.5 for you? I think the sandwich is better. Mm-mm. Okay, out of all the fried chickens though, from all the fast food places. Uh, I think Popeyes always has the best fried chicken. Mm. Better than KFC. Mm. Yeah, that's really good though. Y'all should definitely try it. Holy chip. fuck! Look what came in the mail. They left it on our porch. Yeah, I mean, oh. if they if someone stole it, I mean, are they gonna hang up someone else's plaque that says Carly and Josh? I don't know. I mean, no. I mean people are weird. They might. They would probably just take it just to be like, just, yeah, just to be an asshole. Look at this plaque. I have it. You yeah. Know what I'm Hold on, I'm gonna get a knife. Or yeah. Those nose look good. I'm gonna shit myself too. I'm eating those today. Uh, me and Olivia are. Oh my god, 550 calories a package. Ooh, that's that's a lot. And I add cheese to it. Fuck. <laughs> this is baby's first plaque. This is actually my like one, four. two, three, four. No, like seventh. Fuck? Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. My seventh plaque. <laughs> I love that. I don't want to brag, but like some people never get one plaque in their life, and I got seven. I feel kind of dope. I'm not gonna lie. It's just kind of a pain in the ass. I mean, I just feel pressured opening it on camera. <laughs> 
that looks so pretty. This is actually dope. Hold on. I have to do an Instagram story real quick. Woo! It looks so pretty. I love it. My See, my YouTube plaque at the time was like so ugly. I'm so glad that these are the new ones, they, how they look, because they look way better. I want to request a new one. Guys, if you don't have a food processor, get one, because watch this. Babe, are you ready? It just sliced all of my cucumbers. Oh shit, that's dope. If you guys don't like making salad because you have to cook everything, literally shove it all in here. The only thing you have to cook is this, the lettuce. Cook, I meant cut. <laughs> I do this for my onion, I do it for my tomatoes, you could do this for peppers, you could do it for everything. And it also shreds cheese. You literally put a brick of cheese in there and it fucking shreds it within seconds. I love my food processor, bye. You can also use it as a blender. Amazing. Okay guys, so you know how I've been growing mint? <laughs> Well, I didn't know what to do with my mint, so I made mint ice cubes. And if you boil the water before you put them in the ice cube tray, you can make your ice cubes clear, which makes them look really cool. Look at that. Gosh, this camera sucks at focusing. But look at that. So, I have my own ice cubes. I have no fucking idea what I'm gonna do with this. I think maybe if I just put it in hot water and it could like melt and like make a tea maybe. I don't know. I just needed a way to use them. And then with my other mint leaves, cause I had to harvest it before um, the winter, I dried some up in the oven and I made my own dried mint leaves. So I think I might make a mint tea right now actually, just cause my, Stomach's hurting and I need to wake up. I've been trying to only have one coffee a day instead of having like multiple Sometimes I feel like when I have coffee I crash like in the afternoon and it actually makes me more tired so Oh my gosh, that smells so good. I need to go show Josh Also, I know you guys probably don't care. Here's a little update on my indoor garden So I brought my basil inside. It's actually starting to become like it's really cool It kind of looks like a tree, but yeah, so I actually made a lot of the, my stuff indoor, so I took some clippings of my mint and brought it indoor just because, you know, it's getting cold out. Like, it's getting down to, like, the 50s at nighttime now, so I really need to, like, step up my game and bring everything inside. So I brought everything inside. I mean, my lettuce was already indoors, if you guys can see that, but holy crap, my romaine lettuce is getting so big, and it's drinking up all the water. It's almost running out of water, so I need to refill that tonight. Um, and then those are my other ones. That one's kind of stunted in its growth, so... So I think I'm going to replenish its water tonight. Um, and then, yeah. So this is my basil that I brought inside. Um, it just grew these two little leaves, as you guys can see. So I brought this inside. I, like, re potted it and brought it. It looks really pretty. Like, it looks like a freaking tree. Like, it looks so cool. And then up here, um, that's some more basil that I'm propagating. As you can see, the um, stems are coming from the bottom. I brought this downstairs to show Josh. So I need to bring that upstairs. Uh, more mint. I love having mint tea, so I'm making sure that I save my mint because um, my mint plant outside is going to die soon. It's going to come back next year. Uh, mint comes back every year without doing anything, so it's going to come back next year, but not the point. Um, and then I have some more. I'm trying to grow some hydroponically so that um, I can throw this one out. I have this just in case it dies. Hydroponically, I've never grew it just in water. Like, this is just water. I've never grown it in just water, so I'm kind of iffy right now. I'm kind of being careful with it because because I've, like I said, I've never grown it in water. So that's why I brought some inside of soil just in case I wasn't able to. But it looks like, look at, look at the healthy roots it's growing. Like the roots are all white. It looks like it's growing just fine. And then these are some new lettuces that I started because um, these ones are fully mature. Like this one um, is fully mature. I can just keep cutting and then it keeps growing. Same with this one. This one actually grows the fastest and I highly recommend growing these ones. Um, but eventually these are gonna stop producing for me. I'm gonna have to throw them out. So hopefully Hopefully by the time I have to throw these ones out, these ones are bigger. So these are my new ones growing. This is dead. So yeah, that's what's happening. Hey guys, good morning. It is the start of another vlog. So we've been vlogging and we have like a bunch of short clips. We never really finish the vlog ever. So today me and Josh made it a requirement to finish the vlog today. I did my own eyelash extensions and right now they're looking crazy. I need to go wash them and like this one's like chunking up. Yeah, I need to go like wash them and curl them again. I know they look crazy, just ignore them. Um, but I'm going to the gym for the first time 
and I went once with Josh okay I've been dating Josh for a year and yeah a year now and I've only went to the gym with him one time so basically I've only been to the gym once in one year which is really fucking bad because my job is just me on my ass editing so your girl needs to go to the gym so it's eight o'clock actually it's like 8 37 now so i'll probably get out by like 9 30 um and then i'm gonna go home shower really quickly and then i have a patreon live to do and josh is still sleeping uh he woke up early like the past like four days so i'm letting him sleep in he's probably gonna wake up in like 10 or 20 minutes he always wakes up like around nine so, yeah but i'm gonna go into the gym and um i'll see you guys when i get out i feel like i already regret going to the gym and i haven't even been in there yet <laughs> Hey guys, I'm out of the gym. Um, it wasn't as bad as I remember. It felt really good and I think I'm like back in a habit. However, I didn't bring a water bottle because usually there's just a water fountain and right now I don't have, I lost my lock to like put a locker. So I don't like carrying, cause I have to carry my mask now, my keys, my phone, and then a water bottle and I go from machine to machine and I'm running and it's just a lot to bring everything. So I didn't bring a water bottle cause usually they just have a fountain. But right now, obviously because of COVID, they're not letting you use the water fountain, which I should have fucking realized. So I am leaving a little bit early cause I'm super thirsty like to the point where my mouth is like you know when you get like that thick like foamy spit that's how dehydrated i am right now i am very thirsty if i had a water bottle i probably would have ran on the treadmill for a little bit longer like an extra 10 minutes but holy fuck i'm craving like my body is craving like watermelon and water like i just need fruit and water so um there's a like a farmer's market right there like a discount farmer's market so i'm gonna go and get some fruit and then i'm gonna go home chug some water eat some fruit and then have a shower because i stink so bad <laughs> I got two coffees and then I got some stuff from the grocery store. Well, the farmer's market that I was telling you about. I will show you what I got when I got home. The deals there are so good. Like, I don't know how much fruit is in your city, but like if I go to like an actual grocery store and I get like a, a little like handful of pre-cut watermelon, it's literally like $10. So I'm gonna show you what I got. Um, a lot of these things go bad easily. I think it's kind of like the leftovers that like farmer's market don't sell or like the ones that are a little bit deformed, the ones that like aren't perfect. So that's why it's like discounted. Um, so they go bad a little bit sometimes like fast but i got some blueberries because i want to i didn't get to go blueberry picking this summer i want to make some blueberry pancakes because they're my favorite some blueberry waffles to put in the freezer um because we have a waffle maker so i might as well take advantage of it and make blueberry waffles and freeze them because they're better than like the egg waffles and then i want to make blueberry jam because i love blueberry jam so i want to make some homemade blueberry jam which i wanted to do this summer but i didn't get to go blueberry picking and then the only places that were blueberry picking they all were closed because of covid so yeah so it was three for ten which is like such a good deal but these go bad really quickly like you have to eat them within three days or else they go bad to be honest but i could totally eat watermelon all day long um but i like my fruit room temperature so yeah and these containers, low-key, I keep these containers. They're really good containers. Like, you could put so much in here. So, I love these containers, too. So, it's like a win-win situation. And then, blueberries. Baby's up in his hair. Oh, his hair looks so good. Oh, my God. Mmm. 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 I gotta go get, um... It's not focusing. A minute. Alright. Okay. What were you saying, baby? Oh, I'm saying I gotta go find a mouth guard somewhere. I went to Shoppers. Yeah, he grinds his teeth at nighttime really bad. I grind the f absolute holy fuck out of him. <laughs> <laughs> so I gotta find a mouth guard, and I went to shoppers. Tell me why they have mouth guards that are only for whitening. But not for like protecting like, bitch, your I'm teeth. I'm trying to put them in my sleep. Guys, look at his facial hair. Look up. Oh, I, I can't. Bye, bye, bye. Kappa, Seth, look, I got you a toy. You want to see the toy? Dad's gonna laugh at me. Dad's gonna laugh at the toy I got you. batteries in it and it flops around <laughs> where do you find this amazon where else would i find it duh yeah, everything in our house this is from amazon shit, i know it probably would be like 30 cents okay, hold on. you gotta put batteries in it and apparently it flops around oh no we could charge it this one you could charge <laughs> apparently i feel like kappa is gonna like it and seth but i don't know luna's probably gonna get scared of it oh, I'm trying to find the thing. The there's a zipper probably in the zipper I think I got them two toys. And then, I feel like all things should come charged. And then, what else do I have? What is this? Oh, a smart light switch for a bathroom because I don't, I want to get, okay, so I got one at first because I don't know if I want to put it in the bathroom or if I want to put it in the basement because we always, those are the two lights that we always forget to turn off. So, I don't know. And then, oh yeah, and then I got them this. Let's set this up and see. No, I want to, I want to shower after. 
guys this thing is like okay uh, <laughs> it just like doesn't come out long enough and i thought it moved around like I mean, it's kind of cool, but like it doesn't get them like moving. It should pop out farther. No, yeah, farther and longer. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I ain't playing with that shit. Seth and like Luna like don't like toys anymore. <laughs> You're Hold stupid. On. Hold on. Even you can't catch it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this, especially for the price. I might have to return it. <laughs> Look at this cat right now. And yes, that is the plant that you think it is behind him. <laughs> Like, what are you doing, dude? What are you doing? We got curtains for Ella's room. I don't know if I told you guys, but Josh put up these curtains. Well, there was only one. He thought it came in a pack of two, but there was only one. And we went to go get the second one, and they don't have it at Walmart, so we have to wait for them to come back in stock. Um, but yeah, they're blackout, so that it doesn't wake up Ella in the morning. And it's easier to put her down for a nap, and it's not super bright in here. Um, so, yeah. And I'm editing right now. Josh just cleaned the whole entire house. You so Josh just hung up something in here and he told me to look at it. Oh, okay, babe. So I got this from Walmart because I've been kind of putting off this bathroom because we like barely use it because this is just like the guest one. I still have to get something for above the toilet. Um, but Josh like always comes in here just to wet his hair and he would always put like the towel like crumpled up right here and it drove me crazy So I was like I need this. This is really pretty. I like this one better than the one in our other bathrooms This one looks real good like compared to the one in that bathroom. This one's way better. Yeah, it's gonna be way better now It's like way less ugly. Yeah And cuz yeah, he would always put it like crumpled up right here and it just looked really bad So now we have that up and then we still have to put up like some shelves I have some shelves downstairs that I might just throw up on above there, but I'm not sure yet but yeah Okay, um, but here Josh made the bed. I still have to clean my side We're in charge of doing our own side tables, so I still have to clean up my side table But yeah, he made the bed. I mean he didn't make it the way that I would want to make it But it's the effort that counts. I'll probably fix the pillows later and see he like put the other pillow upside down But that's fine. I'm not gonna complain I'm gonna clean my side table and then do that. He basically cleaned the room. So that's always helpful I still have to put away my laundry but look guys, he cleaned out here. You guys didn't see what it looked like before, but it was awful. Um, there was a lot more dishes in the sink, so yeah, he I mean he did the best he could. He mopped and vacuumed the floors, he cleaned off this table, um, he windexed it, I can see. So yeah, he definitely made it a lot easier in here for me to clean. He organized the shoes over there, so a big help because I just got a vlog done and now I get to come out here and the house is clean. Obviously there's some cleaning that I would want to do, but you know, overall, it looks great, and it's 12 o'clock, and it looks super good in here, and I'm so thankful for him. My man cleans the house. Train your man to clean the house. <laughs> Anyways, I'm vlogging at the moment. Um, so, not vlogging. <laughs> well, yeah, I am vlogging, but I'm editing a video right now. I'm editing a vlog, and I'm also editing like a little promo for my... Um, Patreon in the beginning of it. So yeah, I'm just gonna finish editing and then Me and Josh are pro I'm probably gonna get ready and then me and Josh are gonna film a video. So yeah Okay guys, the majority of my work is done. I know my eyelash is driving everyone crazy. It's drive driving me crazy, too I'm gonna go downstairs and fix. Oh my god hiccups fix it, but Work portion is now done. I went live on patreon. Um, I edited a video. I edited a promo video now the rest of the day is we want to get two videos done for the Carly and Josh channel that aren't vlogs because we vlog anyways, but we want to do like challenges or reaction. We're not really sure yet, or maybe a public prank or a skit. We're not really 100% sure yet, but yeah, Josh is on his bike. I'm about to eat. Um, all I had today was a coffee and an egg and I'm starving um, and I need to just like listen to my body. So I think I'm just going to have a salad uh, with no chicken because I think we're going to have chicken for dinner. So I'm not going to have any chicken. Um, so I'm just going to have a salad. Do you know what kind? Yes, Greek salad. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm going to have a Greek salad and I'm probably going to look up some videos while I'm eating. And then yeah, I don't know what we're going to do next. So I'm just making Josh lunch, I'm making him like a grilled cheese and like meat sandwich with a side of watermelon. Um, I just wanted to talk about this really quickly. I don't know how many people really care, but um, if you guys like Costco and you guys like having sandwiches, this is probably my favorite sandwich meat that there is. I think there's like, I don't really know what's in it. Where's the, 
I don't know guys, but that's what's in it, okay? I don't know, it's really good. Um, I just put like two pieces of like each type of meat or like one piece, I don't know, it depends on if they're like thinly cut or, or not. And what I like about these is that I just put them in the freezer and then like I have like four of them in the freezer and they make like 10 sandwiches guys and the, the combination of that type of meat is so good and then you put cheese and some mayo on it and then grill it up. Oh my gosh guys, you guys will be in love. I froze my bread a little bit weird, so it's like weirdly shaped, but whatever. Bread is bread. Okay, we just pulled to this Halloween store and we get to go through this little hallway. You want to go hey, first? Hey, look, it's you. <laughs> Yo, chill. It's you. Love when we fit in because we're all wearing masks. Yo, that's a fact. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, ready? Me oh. when I wake up in the morning? No <laughs> cap. That's terrifying. I hate clowns. I hate spiders. spiders Fuck are... that, dude. Spiders are the worst. What would you do if you saw that in a forest? I would flip out. That's really scary. Every single girl I know, I know has been this costume. Every single girl. Yo, no cap. Guys, that looks like David Dobrik. Do you know what David Dobrik looks like? Yeah. Doesn't that kind of look like yeah, him? Maybe it's because he's always wearing a hat. And if you guys wanted to know, this is where I got my grills. <laughs> Gold pirate tooth. They don't got the diamond ones here yet though. Is this where you get your jewelry from, Josh? You can't show them. No, I'm dead ass. You can't show them. Costume jewelry? Why do I pay so much money for extensions when I can just come here? Why do I get my hair curled when I can just get that? <laughs> you kind of look like that sometimes. I thought that was Joe Santagano. That does look like Joe Santagano. <laughs> Okay, so where are we going? Oh, where are we going? We're going to the park over here, but there's like... Oh, no, seriously, like, there's a lot of kids at that park. Swing? Oh, you want to swing with us? Okay, ready? One, two... Oh, okay, one, one, two, three. <laughs> yeah, no, there's, there's like a lot. It's almost like there's like a school. Yeah. I forgot, well, maybe they did come back from school and they It looks like, like there's a dead ass of school there. <laughs> yep. Good job! You did it! Can you do it again? I was scared that if I went up, I would fly off. Or like. She went down the pole by herself at that one part. I know. Oh, is it a slide? I thought it was for you to climb up on. Because there's a grip on it. Okay, yeah, so we're eating dinner and I made chicken delights and it's like a mayo based sauce with like garlic and like some other it's really spices. Fire. You think it's good? It's really fire. I've never been, I've n I never get sick of them, like ever. Me either. And I wrap them in tin foil so it's easier to hold and there's lettuce, onion, and then like chicken that's like marinated in seasoning salt. And then Ella's just having some chicken and um, ranch and water and then we're having Diet Pepsi. And Kappa was still playing with that but now he, he's not. But if you guys want the link to it, I'll leave the link. Oh, never mind, I jinxed it. He's going to play with it. He's like obsessed with it and it's keeping him busy. So, and he's not bugging the other cats. So, love that. Caitlin just came to pick really me up. I didn't think it was that bad. Look at her parallel parking job. It wasn't even parallel, there's no cars around. <laughs> Yo, I'm in the night. I'm pretty high. And we're eating pizza pockets. Oh shit, cuz. What's good? But yo, we just made this shit right now. And then and then I'm I'm definitely like gonna go to bed, so. But well, it's pretty hard. And I got new speakers. Yo, they can't even hear more, bro. That shit's too hard. That shit's definitely gonna ball. drop. 
in the vault. We actually we're, we basically got a fucking album now. So we gotta keep dropping. I'm about to shoot a music video too. But anyways, I'm going to sleep. Okay, guys. We never said good night yesterday for yesterday's vlog. So it's the morning and it's the next vlog. But it's we're gonna put this at the end of the other one. Anyways, we love you guys. Good night. And hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Comment down below any video requests that you guys have. And yeah, I love you guys. Bye. Don't take no time off, bad bitch trippin', she throwin' my vibe off Floodin' in diamonds, diamonds still shine when you turnin' the light off Know she gon' ride, yeah, yeah, she be screamin' when I'm up inside, yeah She don't get tired, she come to the crib, I don't gotta invite, yeah Don't take no time off, bad bitch trippin', she throwin' my vibe off Floodin' in diamonds, diamonds still shine when you turnin' the light off Know she gon' ride, yeah